Hi, in this video I'm just going to show you how you can integrate external um, content coming from uh, uh, REST web services into Liferay. So if you have your own content management system and you want to integrate some of the content inside Liferay or if you even you have your own application that expose uh, um, there are services through um, a REST uh, web service so you can integrate this in Liferay and the good news is you don't need to use any um, compiler to do this it's a run time so I'll show you how we can do this in Liferay so I have a demo bundle that I'm running it on my local host so I'm gonna log in now and I have different personas on my demo but just for this video I'm gonna use only one person which is Bruno and Bruno is my super user so he has access uh, to all the administration features so once I sign in the first thing I will do is I'm gonna go ahead and um, open the navigation for the site and create a new page so I'm gonna go ahead and create a new page here and I'm gonna name my page anything so let's let's name it now test and I'll give my page to be one column layout. You can make it one column, two column. You can choose any uh, layout you want for your page. And then once your page is created, you have it on your page. Now I'm ready to start adding my new application uh, to this page. So what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna go to the add button and I'll go to the application tab. And under the application tab, I'll look for something called web content and I will drag and drop and add this to my page and now after doing this uh, what I need to do next is to start adding the code of my application so as you can see here integrating external um, um, REST web service uh, content doesn't need to go to a compiler doesn't need to restart the server I can do it at runtime so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna click add and I'm gonna add a new uh, content but just before adding my code um, I'm gonna open my browser so there is a public uh, um, REST web service that whenever you call it, it get you back all the countries with a lot of details like the language uh, the capital everything so you can actually use this REST API um, it's public REST API so I just use this and I'm gonna create some code live ray to code this uh, rest web service and actually create um, a drop down menu for all the countries and whenever you choose a country it show more details uh, for this country I already created the code I will share uh, the link for where you can download the code under the video but here is just basically I add my style I add um, I add some a script here that actually call um, this API and then they get the results and whenever I choose anything it just shows here the details I, I of, of a specific country that I choose um, and as I said I'll put a link for to download that code after um, under this video so I'm gonna copy the link now and I'm gonna go ahead and add my go to the code tab and now I'm gonna add my code here so that's all my code and now I click done and on the top here I'll give it title so let's say countries countries okay and um, the good thing about it I can still use the out-of-the-box feature that comes with life free even while I'm integrating an external content or external application so for example here I can come tag this content so I I use external content and at the same time I use the out-of-the-box feature coming with life free so I'm gonna um, uh, tag this as uh, new content um, let's say countries so 2017 so those are all tags if people try to tr to search for those tags they find this content uh, the other thing also I can schedule where I want to display this content where I want to remove it where I want it to be expired so I can use all the out-of-the-box feature of life ray right I can also relate this content to other content inside life ray uh, so let's say you have an announcement that you posted in a different system and you want this announcement to be related to a PDF document inside a life ray document repository so by doing this I can come 
uh, add my code to integrate the external content and here I can come and say I want to um, integrate this content with a document inside my document repository so I can come and say uh, this content is related to any file I have in my document repository I'm not gonna do that now but just publish this so now as you can see here I have those contents so anytime I choose any uh, content it just show me the details of this country um, so all of this content is coming from a web service call and I didn't add all of this country so I can anytime I choose a country it just show me all the details of this country out of the box no need to write any um, uh, any code outside of live ray no need to restart the server I have everything running here and anytime I can edit uh, and edit this application and again it has all the out-of-the-box feature coming with live ray as, as I was showing the tagging here also I can do the permissions so for example I can add a permission here to say I want this application to be visible only for logged in user so I'm gonna uh, remove the view permission from guest user and by doing this if for example I log out now so I'm just gonna log out from Bruno just go back to the same page test page uh, as you can see I don't see any application here I need to log in to view this application so as you can see the page is empty there is nothing here if I log in with Bruno and go back to the same page so I'm gonna go back to the test page now I can see the application again so you integrate that content and you can use all the out-of-the-box feature of life ray right um, that was uh, my demo for uh, this video please um, um, check the code on in the link under this video and you can write any question and comments thank you